Lolita's so nice. She's about to be so dead. I know. <laughs> Hello, I'm Nivy. And I'm Cashew. Welcome to our channel. Today we're watching Dragon Stampede, <laughs> episode yeah. nine. Uh, <laughs> last episode, we got a whole bunch of information that I was dying for. So we got to see mm -hmm. uh, when Vash and Nye crashed like the aftermath of that scene where Nye says, Vosh, or whatever he says. <laughs> Vosh. And uh, Vash ran away from the zombies of all the people he <laughs> killed. And then he got found by these other people, which I guess there are multiple ships holding plants or part of Project Seed. Yeah, it seems that way. And uh, it was, what were their names? Uh, Brad and- Luida, I think. And Luida. Louis. Louis. <laughs> yeah, Louis. Uh, yeah, so he basically was ready to die. He didn't want to eat. He didn't want to do anything. He was pretty depressed. And Brad was like, this guy is sus. I don't know about this guy. We don't know what happened. And Louida was like, no, he's just a kid. And then she was nice to him for a while. And Brad was not. And then eventually <laughs> Brad warmed up because Vash saved their plant, which then I guess Vash can talk to the plants. Like that's his thing. He, he mm -hmm. can eat and sleep and all that like a human, but he can like calm the plants down or whatever he has this like power and i don't know if that's exclusive to him mm -hmm. but it sold them on his goodness and then they gave him his red jacket but then they listened to the black box recording and they found out that he was he didn't cause the crash but he unintentionally he was on helped. camera with yeah. Yeah, he unintentionally so. helped and he thought they were gonna hate him so he ran away and then oh yeah well, no actually brad did blame him and then he ran away <laughs> yeah. and then ludo was like no see like he wouldn't have done that on purpose and then brad was like yeah you're right tell him i'm sorry when you find him him. And then mm -hmm. they went out to get him and then Vash woke up older and I don't really know <laughs> how that ended or if those Where people are Where we are alive. in the timeline. <laughs> yeah, and then he, we left off with him confronting his brother, which they both look mm -hmm. younger than current time, but older than that flashback. So yeah, we'll see. This episode's called Millions Knives. You bet it is. And we're going to watch it right now. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. I'm hoping that this is where we get to see everything that happened but knives is side oh yeah that'd be nice look at him he's just playing the piano looking like a normal dude it's a pretty crazy looking piano <gasps> Nye looks angry that he's here and he Vash is just happy <laughs> to hang out with his brother playing double duty maybe now he misses him though <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is where it, the last episode ended. Yeah. The higher dimension. Yeah, the fourth dimension. I said that episode <laughs> one. <gasps> oh. Okay, this will be a good test to see if he can talk to them. Oh. Yeah. I see. I feel like this is kind of in line with what I was saying last episode, where I feel like Nye just cares more about the plants than humans. Yeah. And he probably feels like humans are using them. Yeah. I mean, this is pretty fucking crazy that they're like, yeah. we got to rebuild the thing, so just push them to their limits. And it's like, well, I mean, couldn't we just continue our regular pace and get it done eventually? Nope. Push oh, so they're like literally like electricity. Like, well, I mean, I know that they can produce things, but mm -hmm. this is worse than like president in uh Final Fantasy seven <laughs> because these are like living things hey yeah this is where we left off hug oh. <laughs> hug <laughs> mm -hmm. okay guy <laughs> it's crazy that he had like an evil chuckle too like do you think that this guy here is the guy that is like with Vi now that's a... You know the... Maybe. The, the doctor guy yeah, with, with the, the little girl? Yeah, the scientist looking fellow. Yeah. This is when he becomes Millions Knives. See, he does produce knives. <gasps> oh! Whoa! Like Wolverine! Oh. <laughs> Those are fun weapons. Stop this knife! <laughs> we already killed a bunch of them. <laughs> I mean... That's pretty messed up what they did. Yeah. Can't really blame knives. Mm, you can sympathize. My favorite villains yeah. are the ones who you can sympathize with. 
maybe don't agree with their actions, but you can sympathize and see why they do the shit that they do. For her meddling, every Ooh. ship other than the plant. Oh. We tried to destroy them all. Yeah, he was trying to save the pl the plants, but kill the people. Uh huh. He's trying to liberate them. Is that just? Is that real though? So you bought into that nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, these guys are pretty crazy for not shooting. But... <laughs> I mean, yeah, but you'd have to be such assholes about it. <laughs> yeah. You have to laugh about their death and be like, <laughs> <laughs> they should they be happy, happy to be used yeah, by like, us. You could be a little bit more sympathetic. <gasps> you could hey. be symbi symbiotic. Kill everybody. <gasps> oh no. Oh no! Luida! Yeah. No. Luida's so nice. She's about to be so dead. I know. <laughs> oh. No. Imagine if he did. I'd be fucked up. Poor Vash. These are like two ends of extreme spectrums. Mm -hmm. Like, can't he just be friends with the nice humans and also advocate for the treatment of plants? <gasps> oh, is Vash gonna let him? What the hell? Oh no, he stood, he stood up for her. Ending their brotherhood forever. <laughs> what? <laughs> is he like knocked down? Who? What the hell? Or is he just thinking that this is Rem? Oh. What oh. the hell? Ooh, a power that Knives doesn't have. Oh. He has a black hole in his arm. <laughs> yeah, like Moroku. Gay. Oh, it so really, it really, is, like it really is a black hole, yeah. Whoa. <gasps> oh. That's how he lost his arm. Whoa. Well, he loves Vash, actually, like a crazy amount. Mm hmm. <gasps> An unhealthy amount. How could you aim that at your own brother? That's what he's thinking. <laughs> All I've done, I've done for us. Well, you know, Luita's alive. Yeah, that's. I'm shocked. Also, yeah, the science guy, he's still with them. I bet you're right. I see both sides. Mm -hmm. I think Nye is, uh, he snapped. But I understand what got him there. Brad. Glad he started wearing black instead of white. <laughs> Looks way cooler. It does. Oh, this is now, because his arm is cracked. So Brad's yeah. like alive current yeah, day. I guess. <gasps> Luida? <gasps> Unbelievable. I thought so she like, was the deadest. These are like deadest. his parents, yeah. kind of. His adoptive parents. <gasps> the truth. <laughs> Everyone had to fit in their one-liners. <laughs> mm. Those bugs. Don't trust them. Interesting. Man, mm. how miserable is that? It's like I gotta, I gotta sleep for the next ten years so I can wake up and work on the dock, and then I get to sleep for another ten years. <laughs> I can wake up and work on the exterior yeah. shell. <laughs> I mean, I guess you get to live a long life. Yeah. Of work. <laughs> yeah, I want to know how these people are treating the plants. Mm -hmm. I hope that Vash has changed them in some way. Also, like, grass. <laughs> oh, yeah. I didn't even think about that. I hope that they're not like, this is only achievable if we kill plants. <laughs> yeah. so that's why we do it. You know, it just has to happen. This is all thanks to the mistreating of plants. <laughs> Flowers. Oh, she doesn't know what a flower is. Well, it's crazy she's not, like, taking pictures of this. I guess if this place is sort of like a secret, maybe you don't want to write to your tabloid about, like... <gasps> 
Yeah, asking the real questions uh -huh. here. Look at her face. Yeah, let's just do nothing instead. <laughs> yeah, let's just give up. Fuck this planet. <laughs> what do you mean? What the do you hell? like the way it is? Well, why are you even here, Roberto? Yeah. You could have left. You gotta smoke in the, the greenery. <laughs> yeah. Did he? I didn't think he no, sounded really cool. I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Humans. Okay, Needle Morgan. I mean, it's his brother, so he might be holding out for that. That's natural. Mm -hmm. Damn. He can do it. If Naruto can do it, he can do it. <laughs> you know? Price of that lifestyle is pretty steep in this kind of world. Man, how Brad is sitting, that's how I sit a lot. <laughs> that's really bad. <laughs> <laughs> when I say I'm sloth sitting, that's what I mean. <laughs> Whoa. <gasps> what the hell? Come on. Can they just have like <laughs> one good day? Yeah. You guys need to fuck off for just one minute, man. This moth person? Mm hmm. Did, wait, they took Meryl? We're in the Terror Dome. I never would have known that that little worm boy was going to be... <laughs> Such a huge villain? Like... Yeah. <laughs> Someone is standing over there. Uh-oh. So is, is this moth person a... A plant? Is Blue Summers a plant? Like, Good why question. are they on board? She's a worm? Whoa. That's pretty crazy that he just tried to, like, execute that kid just from, like, hey, whose side are you on? Do you see Wolfwood in the background? Yeah, like, hauling his cross, like, bouncing around. What the fuck? I'm s what is this being? <laughs> That's a great question. Oh, so this is Earth. Did he just say whoa. Earth? Yeah. Oh, whoa. Oh, so this is like, this whole show is just- Post-apocalyptic Yeah, <laughs> about how we're sucking the planet dry and we suck. Well, mm -hmm. I don't suck, you guys suck. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Listen, if I didn't burn down all those rainforests, I wouldn't get my bottle of Mountain Dew Cold Rush. I hope that's a real flavor of Mountain Dew. I don't drink Mountain Dew. <laughs> I just thought it'd be Me funny. Either. Maybe Vash can heal them. It's a beast. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Alrighty. Episode nine? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Episode nine in the bag. Yeah. No? Well, Can't finally, believe it. Yeah, we got even more questions answered. We kind of got to see Knives, his whole experiences leading up to this. You know? I understand. Yeah, I'm super <laughs> glad we got to see that. It's kind of what I thought it was, too. And that's a very extreme but understandable point of view he mm. has. He's not just some crazy person that wants to kill people for yeah, it's yeah, he fun. Just, exactly. He just doesn't identify as a person. Yeah. He's, he's a plant and he wants to protect first. his people or his plants. Yeah. What was up with Vash's arm? That's an excellent question. So I guess he can just make black holes. <laughs> yeah, I guess he can. I remember I thought at first I thought you were talking about the robot arm, but Oh. Because I, I remember in an earlier episode, I was like, what? I don't remember Ash having a robot arm in the mm -hmm. original old show. Uh, turns out I just misremembered and he totally did. 
But it was I like if it was for the same reason. I don't know, but it, I mean, it was like a robot ass arm. It was like metal and shit. Yeah. This arm he's got is like Gemerald Super Technology or something. I don't know what the hell it is. Uh, yeah, probably just some fancy space mm -hmm. rock. You know, turns out. Bash does have the power to conjure a black hole in his yeah. hand, like Moroku. <laughs> yeah, and I think, I actually think that Nai was saving him by cutting his arm off. Yeah, I know, yeah, I agree. Probably. Nai loves his brother. Mm -hmm. I think that's pretty clear. I, in fact, I think he blamed Rem for them not being as close. And I think he just doesn't, he just wants Bash to be like his, his general. Like they yeah. just, he wants to do it with his brother, but. 100% agree. Which is sad for everybody involved. Mm -hmm. I don't know how in the hell, like, like maybe they, it was off screen or something, or maybe I just blinked and missed it. But I felt like Meryl and Roberto, like they were in the like greenery room and then mm -hmm. the scene changed. And when it came back, they were somewhere else and they were like, what, where are we? It's like, what happened? Yeah. Did you get like knocked out or something? Yeah, I think I think those moth plant things broke into the green dome and took them. Oh, okay. And then Luida ran away and was like, oh, the bugs attacked, mm -hmm. worms attacked or whatever. It kind of, when I, when I was looking at it anyway, it just looked like the dome was like cracked and I was like, oh, I yeah. guess they like just bashed it or something and then fucked off. <laughs> but... I, I, yeah, I mean, they didn't show. I just uh -huh. assumed that, that yeah. they broke in and took them like that. Because mm -hmm. I don't know, that worm person has a, <laughs> I don't know, mystery Weird. powers. Yeah, and that's another thing. Why, why is this... I think Zazzy, Zazzy the Beast or something? The Beast. Oh, no, the Beast, the Beast. Yeah, that's, the beast. that's what her name is. Why... Yeah. They are so obsessed with Meryl and <laughs> Roberto. Yeah, like, actually. Even, even the scientist guy was like, what are you doing bringing these people here? Why did you do this? And he's like, I don't have to listen to you. This is, <laughs> I think it's just fun. Maybe it's just entertaining, yeah. I guess. All in all, pretty fucking awesome episode. I, it was, it was. I, I, I really appreciated seeing Nye. Also, sorry, go on. No, I was just saying, I feel it approaching the climax yeah ah so crazy we're only a uh, i don't know a couple weeks away from it being over mm -hmm. although i I, I saw that there is a season two i believe mm -hmm. i think there's like one more season mm -hmm. not out yet but planned good good yeah good for that me too all right guys as always like comment and subscribe all of our socials are in our description and we will see you next time yeah adios goodbye